and here we go in the sandstorm period. Cold Orange with their driven robot there. Oh, they just missed that hatch. Going for a second one. Their alliance partners also trying for hatches. And there's one for the Red Alliance. Citrus Circuits, our number one seed. Gonna be playing some defense with from look, La Cunada. The Blue Alliance is going to have to work hard to get up. They're down a match. The Robux are gonna be putting in cargo along with their alliance partner. 399 tried to put on a hatch, but they missed it. Phantom Cats on the Red Alliance is playing the defense against 399. Eagle Robotics trying to find their way back into the loading station. That defense is presenting that. The Robux looking to get hatch panels on so they can score some points. The Red Alliance is taking a lead, 45-34. La Cunada, some pretty awesome defense over there trying to prevent Citrus Circuits from scoring. Citrus Circuits has pretty good drivers trying to drive around, finding a location. They know where to go, but they put, a, they put cargo in where there was no hatch, so it, didn't, it just rolled right out. La Cunada is moved on to Code Orange, trying to prevent them from scoring. But if you release one, the other teammate will score, either Code Orange or 1678, 1678. They got their panels out. It looks like they may be going for the three robot lift with 20 seconds to go. Oh, 20 seconds to go. Both robots are on. There goes one, there goes two. Three robot climb for the Red Alliance. Right there, Blue Alliance trying to get onto the platform, trying to finish this out with three, two, one, zero. That's the match. Hundred and fifteen points total. Red Alliance had the advantage, so they're going to move on to the semifinals. Let's give a big round of applause for the great competitors for the Blue Alliance, 24-29.